To get going with recruitment, the first thing to do is set up a position. From the left-hand menu, click Recruitment. Now, click Add Position. Complete the information on the Job Information tab. Click the Application Form tab and specify the required information, like what is optional and any you wish to disable. Pipeline contains the standard pipeline that we looked at earlier in Settings. From Scorecard, select the scorecard you wish to use from the drop-down menu. In Practical Task, Choose from the predefined tasks using the drop-down menu. Hiring team lists everyone applicable, simply select the employees that make up the hiring team. In outgoing emails, you can enable a thank you email and friend referral emails. Complete the information in the email body for whichever email you wish to enable. Finally, in visibility you can choose the status of this position. When you are ready, click Add Position. Now this has been added, you have the options to edit or delete this position. You can duplicate it too using the duplicate icon. The job application page can look something like this. The applicant can refer a friend from the top or complete the information themselves and then click Apply. Back in the Recruitment module, Applicants show up in the Applicants tab. To view more information about them, click their name. If you wish to move this applicant along, from the top right click Move to CV Review. If this applicant is not suitable, click Disqualify. Supply a reason and comments and decide if you wish to email this applicant, then click Disqualify. You could schedule an interview from this page also by clicking Schedule Interview. When you move an applicant through the recruitment process you will see them move into the various boxes along the screen, a great way to keep track of who you have at what stage. If you have an application from somewhere other than the Sage HR application page, you can manually add them into this process. From the top, click Add Applicant. Choose how you wish to add them and complete the required information. When you are done, click Save. As with applicants from the Sage HR application page, they will appear in the pipeline process map, waiting to be moved along. Once you have worked your way through the recruitment process and have the required number of applicants in the hired box you will notice a complete hiring process button in the top right. Using this button, you can enter a comment, and this will freeze the recruitment process for other applicants so they can no longer be moved along the process. From the applicant you are hiring, click their name. From the top right, click Hire, then click Continue. You are brought round to the new employee record. Complete this and add your new employee.